Oh, I'm here with uh, Mr. Andy Scott, a uh, post-war Brentford legend. Okay, that's not blowing too much smoke up your um, backside. Mr. Scott, your immediate emotions after what has been an amazing and an historic season? Um, exhaustion, really. Um, it's been a long, it's been a long last five, six weeks. Um, you know, I think when we got started getting the injuries, that was when it was really going to tell on, on the strength of the squad and. And really, what we've done was bring in loan players in, and the players that were here, and their strength. And uh, relief to get over the line. Delight for the fans. Delight for the football club. Delight for the players. Yeah. Well, how's Damien Spencer? I guess we should touch on what looked like a dreadful injury. Another one in hospital. Yeah, he's, uh, it looks like he's, he's cracked. He's smashed his cheekbone. It, was a, it looked awful. It looked worse than Nathan's. I got to say, mm. and he went there, and he was in, <coughs> physically he was in a worse condition than when we saw Nathan. So um, again, it's just. Amazing, really, that's what's happened to our centre forwards. But you know, we've, we've got we're going to obviously exhaust, make sure he's okay and see he's well looked after. I think we all hope he's, he's yeah, definitely. Yeah, best wishes are with him. I, I hope I'm the first person to say this, but bring on the Leeds, the Charlton, the Southampton, and indeed the Leighton. Yes, going to be. We, we I mean, with in private, we've spoken about you know the, the, the fact that this league, League One. It's great to be able to say that now. Um, it's going to be predominantly southern based, and there's some big clubs in there. And the crowd at Griffin Park now, we should be getting tens, twelves easily. Um, you know, if Norwich come down, you've got Charlton, Southampton, you've got the Brightons, <coughs> Northamptons, if Wickham come up, um, Orients, Millwalls. Um, so it's, it's, if you look at it in a, a bigger context than what we are at the moment, you know, it's, it's massive for the club financially for next year. And great for the players to be able to play against the sides um, of that colour. Well, I shall let you speak to the gentleman of the press. Many, many congratulations. Cheers, Blake. I'll speak to you up there in a Cheers. Thanks so much. <coughs> Your players did pretty much everything you'd asked them today, didn't they? Yep, big game for us. A uh, massive game. Um, you know, it was never going to be an easy one, but obviously the sending off uh, can work against you sometimes, but um, you know, the, the players really you know, demonstrated a good uh, patience and obviously a nice goal from Benno got us going and second one before half time settled us all down and you know um, we knew it wasn't going to be easy they were going to come at us they had nothing to lose but you know we, we dominated the game and, and uh, got a nice third goal that just really ran it off and then we're just listening to the cheers for the, from the fans really we didn't know what was going on elsewhere but you know obviously Wickham uh, not getting a win mean we're champions and it's great to be able to say that, uh, that without going to the last day you feel your team deserve it? Of course we deserve it, yeah. I, th I feel that we've been the best side and I think if we'd kept all the players that we had that got injured, um, we'd have a more, um, a, a lot bigger, stronger squad that we could have rotated more. But, you know, the lads gave me everything. Everyone who's played the part this season, and that's everybody. Um, you know, behind the scenes we've got uh, masseurs and fitness coaches that are doing it for nothing. And uh, they just want to be involved with Brentford and that's, that's what we've got as a club. We've got that appeal you know, to want to work with a, a good club that looks after people and they'll be looked after now as well. And how's it feel for, for you personally, a league championship in your first season as a manager? Yes, it's nice, it's nice. You know, I'm not, I'm not really thinking about myself to be honest. You know, I'm delighted <coughs> that um, since I've taken over we've got a brand new squad and uh, the players that I brought in um, have vindicated me bringing them in and, uh, and I'm delighted for them to have a, a championship medal. Now, for some of these boys, first year in league football is, is a fantastic achievement, and uh, you know I won it. <coughs> I won this league as a player, I won it as a manager, and I'm, you know, it's, uh, you know, I'm, I'm very, very pleased for the club and everyone associated with the club.